Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we are going to build this. It looks weird and you might be asking what's that? Well, it's a robot which is powered by wind and it will be walking because of it. It is based on a Theo Jensen's wind sculpture and the principle is the same but it's smaller. Also it is fully 3D printed. You just need a 3D printer and that's basically it and maybe some oil, so there is less friction and the wind will actually spin it. It's a fun toy and also it's a fun thing to build, like for me it, it took maybe 4 hours to build, so you can gift it to somebody to build it, or you can build it yourself and gift it to somebody, like you have a lot of possibilities. If you want to see more 3D prints or some DIY things or some tutorials, you can check out my channel by this link. These are all the parts that you need, and it took about 400 grams of filament, which is quite a lot. All the files are in the description, as always, and to figure out how many of these you will need, you have this picture available on Thingiverse as well. The assembly is not that difficult, it might be quite difficult in the beginning, so to help I printed this paper, with these colors, that they should be quite different, but this is how my printer works. And you also have this image available in Thingiverse to start. For assembly I was using glue gun, because it is easy to use and you can easily remove it if needed. But of course you can use another glue and I wanna know how did it work and which glue you used. I didn't film the whole process because it took like 4 hours to build, as I said before, but I filmed some important parts, for example the beginning, the middle with the gear, and the end. After the assembly was done, I used WD-40 for the lubricant and actually it helped a lot to remove the friction between the parts.
hope the demonstration of the assembly was useful. Now let's test the thing. Well, as I'm in my flat, I will be testing it with a fan. And actually it was powerful enough to move the robot. But when I took it to the beach, the robot was only working when I was holding it because the wind was not very strong. In the future, of course, I am planning to go to the beach with a strong wind so the robot can just go by itself as far as it can. So please, if you want to see it, subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching until this point. If you want to suggest any DIY thing or ask anything, you can do it in the comments. I do read them and I do reply to them. If you liked the video, please give me one of these. If you want to see more DIY stuff, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And I hope I'll see you next time.